talking about King's College criteria for transplantation in acute liver failure. Now, according to the criteria, acute liver failure is first categorized into two based upon the etiologies. One is the paracetamol induced and the other is the non-paracetamol induced. Talking about the PCM induced, the factors that you have to remember in PCM induced are four. And for that, you can remember a mnemonic that is PACE. P A C E. Let me tell you what each one stands for. P is for post moment time, which should be greater than 100 seconds. A is for acidosis, and that means the pH should be less than 7.3. C stands for creatinine which should be greater than 3.4 and encephalopathy is for E and that should be of at least grade 3 or 4 right and that's easy I guess creatinine 3.4 mg per deal of course in the actual king's criteria it's mentioned in micromole per liter and that is around 300 let's talk about the non-PCM induced now for non-PCM induced again one factor is common and that is post in time greater than 100 seconds and then any three of the following five criteria. Now among these five criteria you must remember that two of them are biochem parameters and three are the clinical parameters. First of all have a look at the biochem parameters. One of them is again post in time and the other is bilirubin programming time of greater than 50 seconds and bilirubin greater than 17 mg per deal and among the clinical parameters they have considered age, etiology and the clinical scenario or clinical presentation. For age it should be less than 10 or greater than 40. Etiology will be a non-A or non-B uh, viral hepatitis and uh, that uh, due to drug reactions like halothene or idiosyncratic and uh, jaundice for at least seven days before the onset of encephalopathy so these are the things that you have to remember for the non-pcm induced that's it the mcqs generally ask for the data in this and that uh, you can see that uh, Prothermin time should be greater than 100 seconds and pH less than 1.3. Another thing is about creatinine and bilirubin. That's it. I don't think you need to remember more than this. Mm.